So all those issues that we went through and a couple of more are going to be eradicated if you spend some time making really nice guides like we're going to do here. I'm going to work on the main strap and basically our decimated version, because it's separated meshes, are all split into polygroups. So if you don't have polygroups and it looks like this, you just want to come to the side panel and under polygroups you want to auto group. That's going to split it into anything that is a floating geometry. So you can click that a couple of times if you don't like the colours. What I'm going to do is just turn off the line here because it's a little bit annoying. I'm just going to turn this selection rectangle into a selection lasso and with control shift and A I can basically select and anything that the selection is touching is going to select those polygroups as it's isolated our guides. We can now come to split and then split hidden. We've got two parts. We've got the main strap and the main bag. You'll find that this doesn't have the other symmetrized version. You can bring that along if you want to, if you want to see them both together. Um, an alternative is you can just work on one side and then we mirror it after. That's usually what I prefer just because it's um, less to worry about and it's not doubling up in my, it's not sort of like lagging it about. I'm going to take this strap and then put it into a new folder. That's just a good habit to get into because anytime you do duplications or extractions, it's going to be maintained in that strap. And that's exactly what we're going 